about a beautiful start to the day. It's one of those days you want to grab that cup of coffee, head out on the patio and just enjoy. We've got temperatures right now sitting at 52 degrees. Those winds fairly light and they have been all morning long coming in from the east to northeast at six miles per hour. As far as your morning planner, just get ready to enjoy. If you've got the day off, maybe head out, mow the lawn, take a walk, head to the park. We've got temperatures at 56 degrees by nine o'clock this morning and by 11 o'clock this morning, we're already sitting near 70 degrees. So I do have green bars in place. It might get a little inconvenient out there for the pets. If you've got outdoor dogs like I do, but just make sure that they've got fresh water. Maybe bring them in for just a little bit because these are warmer temperatures than we are used to seeing this time of the year. I've talked about it already this morning. I'll say it again. Yesterday we hit a high of 80 degrees. That was one degree shy of breaking a record. Today we're expecting to see temperatures reach 82 degrees. The old record is 83 degrees. So we're skirting those record temperatures. And I already put my money on the table and I say, yes, we're going to tie it. We're going to break it today. Otherwise, mostly clear skies and quiet conditions overnight tonight. That high pressure in place and that equates to beautiful weather, at least through the end of the week. And then we do have some changes we've got to talk about. As far as your future cast goes, there's that high pressure in place. It is very strong, very dominant through the Pacific Northwest all the way down into California. We dropped all that warm air and today we're actually looking to see the warmest temperatures of the week. Tomorrow still not too bad. Friday not too shabby either, but out in the Pacific it's getting busy and we'll start to see this high pressure ridge break down. It's going to bring in some cooler and some unsettled weather as we head towards the weekend. But for now, let's just enjoy this temperatures in the mid to upper 80s for many areas. Colville 87 degrees sunshine across the board with temperatures near 90 degrees today for places like Moses Lake and Othello. When Natchi checking in at 87 degrees Leavenworth, we just saw that gorgeous picture uh, there from Icicle Creek 85 degrees today. My friends in Davenport, good morning. 83 degrees in Ritzville today into the mid uh, 80s as well. We've got temperatures into the 70s, low 80s towards Missoula down through the LC Valley. We're in upper 80s around Spokane. We've got mid 80s through the valley, mid 80s. It is going to be gorgeous no matter where you're headed. And if you've got to stay indoors today, you got to work. The one upside, air conditioning. The downside, you don't get to enjoy the sunshine. We're going to give you a lot extra time to do that because by 6 o'clock tonight, we're still sitting at 81 degrees in our sunset. Not until 748 and those temperatures still sitting in the 70s. And by 10, 11 o'clock tonight, we've got temperatures in the upper 60s. So cool very comfortable conditions as we head into the overnight hours. Let's take a look at that 3D planning forecast because a lot of people wanting to know about that weekend forecast. Jean checking in because they've got a wedding this weekend. We do have changes on the way. They arrive as we had overnight Friday and into Saturday 80s through Thursday. Then you see that uh, slight decline on Friday. Look what happens as we head towards the weekend and you can see that the wettest days of the week come Saturday and Sunday. Now these are scattered showers that we'll see throughout the weekend. Here's the good news. We will start to see things quiet down as we head towards the first half of this next week. And guys, we'll see a return to temperatures back into the mid 60s. Sean.